Hey guys, thanks for joining me. This is the 2023 Infinity Q50 Red Sport Opal Edition. For the Opal Edition, they blacked out everything. And then for the Red Sport, you do still get the same exterior styling accents. Taking a closer look at the vehicle, you can see the front end is completely blacked out. Same thing with the rears, which we'll get to in a little bit. If we get the lighting on, you can see the LED turn signals. You do get the exterior body styling kit, like I mentioned. The Infinity emblem is illuminated. It should turn off. There you go. So you can see that it does illuminate and it does stay lighting whenever you are driving the vehicle. Here's the side profile of the vehicle. It's pretty much always stayed the same. I am going to compare this to a Midnight Black uh, Q50 so that way you guys can see the color differences. Lighting has to be very unique or very particular for you to see the purple and the green. If we go back to the rears, before we do, you do get keyless entry in the front. You can see green right here. You don't get it in the rears, which I really wish they did. You can see the green back here for the Q50. Locking the vehicle, you can see your LED daytime running lights, turn signals, or tail lights. And then down below, you do get the exclusive exhaust tips. Everything is blacked out for the Opal Edition. And then you do get the carbon fiber deck lid spoiler, which looks really nice. Let's go ahead and take a look at the interior. Popping into the interior, you do get keyless entry in the front. Door panels has pretty much stayed the same over the years. Memory seats, Bose audio system, automatic window controls, illuminated kick plate. You do get the illuminated Infinity logo with welcome lighting. Down below too, that is an accessory. You can see the Napa leather quilted interior. Let's hop on in. If you were hoping for things to change, nothing changed in the interior. You still get that same analog gauge style. You still get the dual screen layout, wireless CarPlay. You do have heated seats. Really nothing's changed. Go watch other reviews. It's exactly the same. Uh, and then you get a sunroof. So not much to tell into the interior. I can light it up for you. I'll push button start this up here. You can see how everything lights up. It's not actually flashing. It's the video or the video quality that's shown. And then you do get maps, which hasn't been updated over the years as well. And then you do get a 360 camera. What so everything wants to load. That's how the interior looks like. So not much has changed. The rear is exactly the same too. It's mainly the exterior styling. Before we hop on out, let's open the hood. Underneath the hood, you're gonna have the same three liter twin turbo V6. That pushes out 400 horsepower, 350 pound feet of torque. It still made it to a seven speed automatic transmission. And yeah, that is the Q50 foil. So I have the Opal Edition and I have a Midnight Black. So enjoy, I'm gonna show you takes of it and you guys can see the color difference between the two. So here's the front quarter panel of both the Opal Edition and the Midnight. Opal Edition to your right, to your left is the Midnight. Let's go ahead and take a look at the side profile. So here's a look at the side profile. Not sure if you can see the color difference. Lighting does not do the Opal Edition justice at all there's a side profile and then going back to see the midnight here's a look at the rears of both you see darker green versus the black and you can see the exhaust tips for the red sport this is just a sensor you can see side profile here let's see if i can capture it see the color difference to conclude the video the red sport opal edition was about 64,000 the sensory with the midnight black color is about 55,000 underneath the hood is still the same engine but that pushes out 300 horsepower 295 pound feet of torque again the red sport has 400 horsepower with 350 pound feet of torque and then you can see the exterior styling accents and differences between the two but that concludes my video I know I did a better uh, comparison between the two with the pink color because I know with the Opal Edition, that's what it's all about. Feel free to go ahead and check out my short. I'll have it in the description below, which shows the coloration a lot better. I'll see you guys in the next video.